How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? This is Lucian Sword, and I'm back again today with some Oberholic content. Um, we have some brand new skins. We have the Witchfire Brin. It just came out today. Looks really nice. I like the uh, the base color, but we can go ahead and look at all the colors. We got community colors there. Sky Forge looks so good. Home team also looking so good. And then I'm just going to kind of quickly go through the rest of these so you guys can get an idea. And there's the black and the white. And then I'll just go through these. The gray looks pretty pretty dope all the time, actually, I think. <laughs> Hope you guys are having a fantastic day wherever you guys might be. Uh, let's just quickly look at the uh, axe. Meh, not that great. The spear, definitely looking a little sharp. I kind of like it, not going to lie. And then the other new skin we have is the Dragon Heart Ember, which, mm, I mean, the, the helmet, the dragon helmet looks awesome. The bow looks awesome. I like the little details they put right there with the dragon faces. Um, I really like it. Overall, I'd give this skin probably, oops, probably like a 8 out of 10. It's, it, 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 it's very nice, as PewDiePie would say. So there's the base colors. We got community colors, meh. We got Skyforge looking really nice. I actually like that probably the best. Ooh, actually, never mind. Hope Team looking even better, maybe. That's not bad. I like that how the eye really stands out in the dragon uh, helmet there. And then we have these. I also have the black ember, which looks really good. And, uh, ooh, red. You know, some of these, like, base colors or whatever actually look really good. Like, most people never use them, but they're actually pretty good. Like, you never see a yellow like anybody or a green or anything. Maybe it's just me, I don't know, but... So, um, yeah, we're gonna play with these skins a little bit today. Let's do, uh... I actually feel like doing a free-for-all. Like, nobody ever does free-for-alls, and I want to do it. Do you guys think I could get nine kills in the free-for-all? I doubt it, but that'll be my goal. Let's see if I can get nine KOs. Might be kind of hard with Bryn, because she's not a huge damage player. And then, you know, you got all the, uh, factors of just being a lucky in free for all because it's so it's so chaotic it's hard to really do like all skill based play all the time you're almost got to button mash a little bit every now and then um it's not a bad thing though you know free for all a lot of people complain about free for all i actually like it i think it does take skill to be good at free for all different kind of skill than it takes to be good at 1v1s obviously but skill nonetheless I know many people that are great, excellent 1v1 players, but then when you put them in a free-for-all, they suck. They just can't handle the, uh, everything that's going on the screen at once, you know? Their brain likes to focus on one thing really, really, really well. You put 15 things going on at once, it just can't, just can't handle it. Other people, they're the opposite, you know? In free-for-all, they excel, maybe, but then in 1v1, they're not so good. So it just depends. I don't think one mode is particularly better than the other. I think they're just different. All right, let's do it. Doggy is love, doggy is life. All right, all right, these guys aren't gonna let me get my taunt. That's all right. See, to win free for all, here's what you guys don't know. You gotta be watching the health of everyone else. You see the people in the red, you go try to kill them. I can already tell right now that Syndra is gonna be my main competition, probably. Never mind, she just killed herself with that beautiful bomb. <laughs> Ooh. Oh my gosh! Garaza side sig! Okay, well he died instantly for that. This is getting out of hand, guys. I don't know about Oh god, I lost where I was. I could really use a kill right now. Barraza, you're not helping me. Did I get Sidra? Oh, I can't believe she dodged that. And then Jala stole my kill. No! Yes. Finally got one. No, Sidra! Not like this! Ah! Okay, guys. Two minutes and a half. I'm down by two, three points. I got this. I got this. Forget about the nine kills. I'm not even going to get that, probably, but I will try to get first. Oh. Ugh. 
Rin will be much better if I do free for all good. Oh, nice read. Most people just assume you're gonna uh, go back to the stage, and I don't. And he actually read me instead of assuming what I was gonna do. Very, very good kill by Jala. Who is that? Zero, zero something? Yes. Is, uh... Baraza... Okay. Jala just got a free kill on Baraza. Sidra, you take it the cheap kills to win. He's not even here. Oh god. I went right into that. Looks like Jala's got this in the bag, man. I was the only chance. Actually, there's still a minute left. Nice dodge by Sidra. I mean, Jala. I wanted to take Sidra. Oh, and we have Baraza back in the house. Oh god, this is actually... No! Well, I was only down by one anyways. <laughs> oh well. Got the six KOs. Not not the nine like I wanted, but whatever. Alright, let's let's hop over to the Witch Fire Bren, guys. I got a feeling. I got a feeling. You know what? Instead of Free For All, let's do... Should we do Experimental? All right, let's do experimental. I'll do that. Um, let's do the uh, Witchfire Brin uh, base dance. Not really digging the axe though, guys. Not gonna lie. I'm gonna switch it over to the Spite Bringer. The spear's all right. We can we, we can work with that spear. Hmm. I'm I gotta say, BMG has been kicking it up a notch when it comes to their skins. I really think that these skins have uh, been really really good lately. All right, going against Three, Publish two, Peace, one, who has disconnected instantly. That's kind of odd. All right, you know what? I'm not even gonna, not even gonna go there. I want, I want a real match. Let's, let's try that again, shall we? He was a diamond boarder too, so it's not like he saw me and then quit because I'm diamond. He probably just uh, had to go or something. By the way, what the heck, BMG, is with this stupid platform thing over there? Bring back the regular island. I hate that island. It, you might as well not have it. Wow. Nice at that grab. Get off of me! Bryn's my original main, man! Kill me like that. I'm still alive. Oh, he was patient. He's like, I'm not gonna let him live anymore. Let's do it, whiskey. 
Right in the back. Right in the back with the pointiest of spears. Oh, that was cool. We both did that. <laughs> yes, <laughs> got him with the unarmed. GG, GG. That was funny, man. We both did the same thing. Great minds think alike. <laughs> that was good, man. That was too good. <laughs> we both did the, the gravity cancel down light unarmed. All right, let's do Ember again. Uh, this time, one v one experimental. I'm gonna I'm gonna switch up the bow. Let's do my fa favorite bow, which is the wild hunt. And for her katars, let's give her something a little more pointy, shall we? How about the uh, um. The Devourers. Those just look sick. I actually do have Dragon Claws. Should I? You know what? I forgot about that. I actually have Dragon Claw Katars. Dragon Tooth. Sorry. Do I have any Dragon-ish bows? Hmm. I don't know, man. Let's see. I have a lot of bows. Wicked Wings. Eh, kind of, I guess. Wi Wyvern Bane. That's that's actually killing dragon, so that would make sense. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. So basically, I have the the Wyvern Bane bow, the Dragon Slayer bow, the Dragon Tooth guitars, and I'm wearing the Dragon Helmet. So I'm basically a straight up Dragon Slayer Ember. Speaking of dragons, my boy Zach Carrion. Some of you might Boner Patrol, nice bro. My bro Zach Carrion got dueling dragons in Rocket League. Some of you Rocket League guys will know what I'm talking about. Dueling dragons, he got it in a crate on the Switch, and then he got it on the PC, on Steam. He likes to jump up. Ooh, nice grab from behind. Oh my gosh. Oh, I thought I'd get him with that weapon throw. His guns are good, man. So are his guitars. This guy probably Billy Diamond. Oh, I gotta stop doing those six. Does another six. Neutralite, neutralite, neutralite. He's very patient, so he's gonna force me to be the same. Get off of my stage. Oh, that's gonna be it. 
A nice one. Though I did have a pretty dang good string on him there, so maybe I can come back. I got this, guys. Told ya. Sometimes it is best to just go straight face. Don't worry about the weapon. Down to the wire. Oh, got him with that down sig beautifully. GG, man. GG, Bonum Patrol. All right, guys, let's do one more. This time back with the Brin, and this time back with the Black. I'm gonna do a little different axe. Um, let's do the uh, Heartbreaker axe. And for the spear, the heart seeker. Why not? Brand. Just to, just to give her some love. We don't want anybody to be salty over here. Bam! Sensei Tamakiro. By the way, guys, um, if you made it this far in the video, I'll give you a uh, preview of what I'm going to be working on in the future. So. Um, Probably many of you are Dragon Ball Z fans, probably safe to assume. Anyways, Dragon Ball Fighter Z is coming out on Friday. And I intend to be playing it. I already pre-purchased. Oh, beautiful read. Anyways, I'm going to be doing some Dragon Ball Fighter Z campaign on this channel. Hope you guys... Oh, beautiful. Do it again, though. Also... Dark Souls on the Switch! So if that is something that you're interested in, then I got you guys covered. This guy's good, man. And it's also the remastered version. Oh, if I would have released, I would have got him, man. He got lucky there. Oh, 
know that game. Goodbye. Ooh. GG, GG. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please go ahead and show the support by dropping a like. Um, be sure to comment if you have anything to say whatsoever. I love hearing what you guys have to say. Um, but yeah, Dragon Ball Fighter Z in the future. And uh, hopefully YouTube doesn't like flag it so I can't make any money or anything. That would suck. And uh, uh, Dark Souls on the Switch, man. I might be doing a playthrough of that. I did a uh, walkthrough for Dark Souls 2. Some of you old timers might might know me from there. Also did a, a walkthrough of Bloodborne, and uh, I'm not gonna do a walkthrough of Dark Souls Switch, but a playthrough rather. Um, I've already beaten it a couple times, so it shouldn't be too too difficult for me. But I love Dark Souls, one of my favorite games, and I'll probably just be doing a little bit of that. Keep doing the Brawlhalla, of course, but you know, sprinkle some other games in here and there. Anyways, guys, um, hope you enjoyed these games. I will see you guys next episode. Thank you, BMG, for giving me two skins for two of my favorite legends, and thank you for making them so awesome. Such a such a great honor to play a game um, with with developers that actually listen to the community and uh, just just are generally awesome people. All right, guys, take it easy. I will see you next episode.